The MP for Romsey and Southampton North spoke to BBC Breakfast's Roger Johnson about a government scheme set to launch on Monday which will encourage British homes to take in refugees fleeing war in Ukraine, and will include a thank you payment. When she was questioned on the BBC Morning Show about the government's slow response to the crisis so far, Noakes agreed more needed to be done sooner. The last couple of weeks has seen widespread criticism over the UK's speed and scale in response to the crisis. What can be done to speed up this visa process? Johnson asked Noakes. The MP replied, well, I think we've seen a number of changes over the past few days even, which includes taking biometrics from people in the UK. I gather there is a massive backlog in them at the moment, so that's progress. But I also welcome the appointment of Lord Harrington as the minister to oversee this program. He has massive experience in the Home Office with the Syrian Refugee Scheme. And I think it finally shows the government has identified people in the UK want to help. They want to offer up their homes. Now we just need to get this coordination and visa issuing all moving so that people can begin to come here. Johnson asked, you said those HMRC staff should have been moved over weeks ago, implicitly that the government has been too slow. Many people have been very critical of the speed of the response, I mean, has it been embarrassing for you as a conservative MP how slow it's been? Well I stood up in the House of Commons this week and described it as being at a snail's pace, Noakes pointed out. And I think it's important that there is cross-party unity on this. There are people from all sides of the House of Commons saying this has to be faster, I am one of them. Johnson remarked, there are people who watch who quite reasonably hold the view that actually we have Syrian people who come over, we've had people over from Afghanistan, we have plenty of people who were trying to process as refugees and we don't need any more and they're not willing to help. What would you say to them? Looking stunned, Noakes replied, well, I sit here in horror at the phrase we don't need any more, no. We don't need people, we need to help them. It is a privilege to be in a position where we can offer support to people who are fleeing war. Viewers watching took to social media to comment on the interview. Twitter user Sir Dave Gray Fox wrote, well said Caroline Noakes just now on hashtag breakfast we need to help refugees and it should be a privilege to do so. Welcome view from a Tory. At Lydia Tepet Bend, Caroline Noakes. Bravo for speaking out on hashtag breakfast against those who would say no to refugees. Sickening attitudes she stated, and reinforced that we need to help. Not what I expected to hear from a conservative. So credit to her. Jonathan Blake commented, FMR Immigration Minister at Caroline Noakes welcomes homes for Ukraine scheme but says QNS about tax implications for householders taking people in need answers at breakfast. Sick. It is a privilege to be in a position where we can offer to help people. At Caroline Noakes is absolutely spot on regarding our responsibility to help those seeking refuge from war in hashtag Ukraine hashtag breakfast, Ben Cottom argued.